My name is Richard Pomeroy. I'm a potter. Everything I make is from porcelain, but that has a reputation for being a, a sophisticated, high-end kind of clay. But I like to make very simple homeware with it. Around uh, the beginning of 2015, my daughter came back from New York. She'd been out there doing illustration. She's an illustrator. She also did a bit of ceramics. She came back and she said, Daddy, let's set up a pottery. I want to carry on doing it. So she went onto eBay and got the kiln and uh, set it up really for her in the cellar here in our house. I then thought, well, I'll have a little bit of a go. I put my thumbs into the clay and I simply couldn't stop. And I went through the whole process from thumb pots to coil pots and then ended up rolling out the clay to make hand-built slab pots. They're never perfect. They're never absolutely right. They could always be better next time. And I think that's such a motivating factor. Porcelain is so, so tricky. And also, imperfection is actually part of the charm of these things. How can you make something imperfect just right? Mm, not sure. But anyway, I started feeling these things are special. Only about three years ago. It's such a special material. I think it's going to feed me for many years to come and I'm still going to be inspired by it. I worked as an artist for 20 years before I started potting. And that was always working on my own. And I guess that although that's something I'm totally used to, I discovered it's more fun with other people. Yeah, and life has to be fun. You might think for two reasons. One, because I'm an artist. Two, because this has a certain look about it, that I've sat down and decided how it's going to be. But actually, I don't at all. I never drew these things out. I never thought, what do I want it to look like? The process was actually made by the clay itself. You end up with something that does look different and fun, but I didn't sit down and think, how am I going to make a coffee pot? I just simply made a taller beaker and folded it up. 